BAM! BAM! Meow, yes. Much meowing indeed, Balto. Look at him, he's so cute laying there at my feet. Right, okay. Public service announcement for charter internet services and, and, and assorted additional services that they offer. Here's the thing. Their residential service package does not include a static IP and that's what a gamer needs to game at an awesome level with. Now, this is the problem that I myself have had and been a complete fucking dim-witted bitch idiot with and bitched about it religiously because I didn't fucking understand or know what the fuck was really going on. When I was playing previously, several years ago, fade in memory thingy, fuck it, who cares? Uh, my folks were paying for the internet and it was on a dynamic IP on a um, on a resident no, a residential package the problem with that is it rotates every five to fifteen minutes and because it rotates like they get used to sending information to a mailbox right let's let's break it down with the analogy of they're sending mail to a mailbox, and then you go and change address without letting them know, and they're, they're like, what the fuck? So they have to relook you back up and send mail to your new address. It's happening in your gaming console every 5 to 15 minutes where your router is changing addresses. So they have to reroute the information every 5 to 15 minutes. And that's why you see all these gamers with laggy freaking connections, and that's why... A lot of gamers that uh, yell and scream about stuff having lag or some bullshit get yell and scream about it. So to solve the problem, yeah, it's going to be more expensive to get a business package, but it's well worth it. Because once you get that static IP information, you go over to your, your settings your network in your console and you plug those numbers in and and your lag almost disappears completely it becomes far and way less noticeable so if you're gonna stick with the internet on a, a freaking dynamic IP please don't bitch about it Hey, for, for you guys with Charter Internet, talk to them about their business package. Yeah, it's going to be more expensive. It's going to be like a couple of hundred dollars worth at the most. But it's worth it. If your folks are paying for your internet, then you're going to have to do some heavy convincing so that they'll get the... Um, the business package and then pay for the the extra for the static IP when you get the business package you're gonna have a dynamic IP and you're gonna have to pay extra for the static IP you can get up to five of the little buggers but uh, for for all intents and purposes just tell them you only need one static IP and then you plug that information you write it down They'll tell you. They'll be more than happy to tell you your static IP. You write it down with the DNS, the gateway, the IP. You write all that down, then you plug it into your console. After that, your latency bit, your lag, is going to drop down significantly. All, all this appeals to... I just got off the phone with them, and there was a massive... Uh, service upgrade in my local area so now I'm getting double speed that I was paying for and I'm still paying the same price so instead of um, <clears throat> instead of a hundred download I'm gonna be getting 200 download 
and instead of 10 upload, I'm going to be getting 15 upload, all at the exact same price that I've been paying. When they do these upgrades, these service upgrades, usually they'll send you a flyer in the mail. You call them, you talk to them about it, you see how much extra it's going to or not going to cost. Like with me, it didn't cost me a single penny to upgrade to their new standard. So, for everybody who's bitching about it, saying, Oh, my internet's complete shit because it's all laggy. The reason is because you're using a dynamic IP address. And uh, the secondary reason would be how far you are in real-world distance from their server nodes. I don't know how far I am from my local server node. And I don't think I can talk with them about it because that's a, that's, that's a subject that none of the agents I've spoken with know anything about so far. <clears throat> Either that or they don't really want to talk about it at all. But that's it for this video. Till next time, fuck right off.